And it's time now to find out the latest in sports from the sunny side, from Sunny Young and the sunny side of sports. Hello, sports fans. I'm VOA Sunny Young with the sunny side of sports. Let's give a sunny side of sports salute to Ethiopia's Dariba Merga and Kenya's Selena Koske, who won the men's and women's titles at the 113th Boston Marathon. Dariba won decisively in Boston, clocking two hours, eight minutes, and 42 seconds. Meanwhile, Koske won a thrilling sprint finish against defending champion Dire Tune of Ethiopia. Also in Boston, South Africa's Ernst Van Dyke won the men's wheelchair race for a record eighth time. From Boston, we go to Belgrade, where Victor Keegan, running in his first marathon, and Ann Koske completed a Kenyan sweep of the men's and women's titles at the Belgrade Marathon. Now let's go to London, where England sports stars David Beckham, Andy Murray, and Denise Lewis have joined in the fight against malaria in Africa. They were part of a group that visited Prime Minister Gordon Brown to ask him to send a plan 20 million malaria nets to Africa by the end of next year. Turning to tennis, world number one Rafael Nadal of Spain became the first man in history to win five consecutive Monte Carlo Masters titles. Nadal defeated Serbia's Novak Djokovic in three sets in the final of the clay court event. As a result, Nadal will be a hot favorite to win a fifth consecutive French Open title when that clay court event begins May 24th. Finally, here in Washington, world number one golfer Tiger Woods met with President Barack Obama this week. Tiger also promoted his annual tournament, which will be held just outside of Washington in early July. The Sunny Side of Sports welcomes your questions and comments. You can send me email at sunny at voanews.com. I'm VOA Sunny Young, and that's the Sunny Side of Sports. Well, thanks to you, Sunny Young. Please watch out for the Sunny Side of Sports each Friday right here on In Focus. Now, for more information on these stories, please go to voanews.com/tv to Africa.